have our crispy mozzarella cheese and fish sausage corn dogs retail price it was $16 but they dropped it down to $9.90 okay and if you decide to like uh, buy a lot if you spend $50 that's free delivery oh my god it smells amazing okay so unlike american corn dogs korean corn dogs okay they're also called hot dogs in korea lah, okay they actually use a wheat or mochi rice flour um, batter in place of cornmeal resulting in a chewier tech one packet 990 and inside got five pieces each okay and even better we were so pleasantly surprised when we opened them up okay Inside, right, everything is, uh, is individually packaged already, okay? So this one is a corn dog with a chewy fish sausage and fresh mozzarella cheese that stretches to the last bite. You know, mozzarella cheese, right, is like the kind that you put in pizza and everything. Every time you take a bite, it's like one long string. Wow, super short, okay? You can now enjoy this wonderful snack at home by by storing it in the freezer and then you can put it in the microwave like i mentioned we have two types so the one i'm holding right is the half and half corn dog so as you can see the top half right it's cheese and then the bottom half is the fish sausage okay so really awesome and then the other one which is this one this is just full-on cheese for you okay if you're a cheese lover please go ahead wow how to prepare it is very easy you just remove the packaging and then put it in the microwave okay on a microwave safe plate of course okay uh maybe you heat it up for like one minute if you have one corn dog one minute 40 seconds for two corn dogs and two minutes 30 seconds for three okay and also depending on the temperature of the microwave you will need to have different timings uh, okay you can find them on the listing do not worry we will not just leave you hanging and of course you can also air fry it like what we did uh, preheat at 170 to 80 degrees for five minutes put the hot dogs in and then you just cook it and then you eat it we have the Baba Gimbap! Retail price going for $8 but promo price $4.90. Uh, if you spend above $50 because you like to mess buy, you will get free delivery. And do you guys know the difference between Gimbap and Sushi? Because they are essentially both rice wrapped in seaweed, right? But the thing about Sushi is that uh, Sushi usually features raw fish. Uh, seafood vegetables and then the rice is seasoned with the sushi vinegar and sushi refers to this vinegar rice whereas kimbap is seasoned with sesame oil and does not include uh, raw fish instead kimbap fillings right they include meats that are already cooked like grilled bulgogi cheese kimchi ham and eggs and the thing about kimbap is that you actually can consume it warm okay you never eat warm sushi right so kimbap you can eat it warm so under this listing there's three different types okay three flavors uh, but i've already heated them up and they're already like placed nicely here so first up we have the tuna mayo okay this one tuna mayo and as you can see here right the tuna mayo it is really uh, quite substantial i would say and they added five secret seasonings inside to really bring out that umami and uh, just to note, this does uh, contain eggs, soil, and sulfurous acid, just FYI. So in case you're allergic to anything, do take note of that, okay? And then we have the dried squid gimbap. So this one comes with the special gojujang sauce and savory butter to make the dried squid gimbap even more tasty, okay? And it also contains egg, soy, uh, milk, crustacean, fish, squid, shellfish, and sulfurous acid, okay? So, in case you're allergic to anything, especially seafood, like this is not for you. <laughs> and then, we have something for the vegetarians. They have the fried tofu burdock gimbap. So, this one is sweet fried tofu gimbap seasoned with boiled tofu and burdock. And for this one, it contains soy and wheat. So the great thing about this, right, is that uh, when you pull it out, it comes all nicely packed for you in a tray, okay? And this, when they made it, right, it was subjected to minus 45 degrees, quick frozen. 
to really preserve the food well. And the tray itself, right, it is separated nicely into three parts, okay, so that you can have an uh, even heat distribution when you put it in the microwave, okay. Imagine if everything was like come together, I think you wouldn't be able to like heat the parts in between very well. So, very easy to prepare, okay. I just put the tray inside the microwave for like two minutes to three minutes and then you have yourself a delicious meal. I that all done. I that done. Your dinner. Girl dinner. <laughs> so this one is produced in hygienic HACCP certified facility. So you know that they do it right. We have the Lotte Mart. Good today. Americano coffee in real black, sweet and hazelnut. 2.1 liter. As you can see, okay, retail price it was $12, but today you can get it for just $7.90 for one big boy. And something I've learned is that the Koreans really love their Americanos, okay? You can find them drinking it in K dramas all the time, all year round. And they even came up with a phrase even if I freeze to death, iced Americano, please. And in Singapore, right, I would think that our official drink is a uh, bubble milk tea. But in Korea, it is definitely the Americano, okay? And apparently, the Koreans call the Americano ah ah. And the people who are hardcore Americano drinkers, right, they even have a name, okay? Uh, I don't know whether I'm pronouncing it right, but Iojuka, okay? And these people, right, they love their iced Americano so much. They will even drink these iced drinks below zero degrees in winter. This is really like for people who love their Americano, right? They want to put it in their office. They want to have Americano at any given time very easily. Uh, this is really very good for you, okay? Inside one packet is really 2.1 liters. How many servings does that mean? How many, how many times? 21. This one? Yeah, these are real black. This one is a uh, Nutri Grade A, so really very healthy. You can see it for yourself here. Nutri Grade A, okay? I'm not bluffing. Uh. So, uh, in case you didn't know, Americano is basically an espresso that's diluted with water. So, basically, kopi o kosong uh, in Singaporean terms. We also have Americano Sweet, which is kopi o, because uh, you do put a bit of sugar into kopi o. La. But this one, because of the sugar, it becomes Nutri, nutri Grade B. We have a nuttier kind of flavour. Uh, they have the Americano Hazelnut. This one is also Nutri-Grade B. 